Oh, hello, and welcome to another exciting episode of Greek Otaku's Reading List. Let's begin, shall we? Number one on my reading list was Bakuman. Free by Sugumi Oba. Art by Takeshi Obata. First published in Japan by Shuisha Inc. Originally published in English on issues 89 to 91. Translation and adaptation by Tetsuchiro Miyaki. Editor Amy Yu. The story follows an average Joe high school student named Moritaka Mashiro, who likes to spend his idle hours drawing. He decides to lay waste to his sketching skills and become a simple desk lackey for some humdrum corporation, until one day a would-be writer and fellow student named Akito Tagai stumbles upon Moritaka's notebook and sees his drawings. He then waited for Moritaka to return for his notebook, and when he does, Akito persuades Moritaka to join him in making the next hit manga series. The next series I started watching was Tiger and Bunny. The story follows a veteran hero named Wild Tiger who is one of many super-powered humans, known as Next, that appeared in the world 45 years ago. A good portion of these Next fight crime in the city of Sternville, while on the hit show Hero TV. But not all of the Next use their powers for good. Wild Tiger is a very experienced crime fighter, however, his ratings are slipping, so he is forced to team up with the rookie with an attitude, Barnaby Brooks Jr. Can they overcome their differences and become a well-oiled team against crime? Well, you'll just have to read and find out. Number three on my list is Roni Kenshin Restoration. This manga follows the life of Hamura Kenshin, a ronin who was once known as the legendary Hitokiri Bakutousai, an unforgiving assassin back in the Bakumatsu era. However, nowadays he has vowed to only draw his sword to protect the innocent. Unfortunately for him, his little pipe dream is constantly being pushed to the limits when his old comrades hear of his new, conformed ways. Number four on my list was Soul Eater Not, story and art by Utsushi Ukubo, published in Japan by Square Enix. Soul Eater Not is a spin-off of the hits anime series Soul Eater. It turns out that DWMA, Death Weapon Meister Academy, has two different units in it. The EAT category, which is especially advantaged talent, the top 10% who battle evil, and the not category, normally overcome target. 90% of these people are non-combatants. But you guessed it right, this series follows the bottom 90%, the not category. Main characters are Sugumi Haridori, she's a weapon, Mimi the Meister, and Anya a Meister. It is a very intricate love triangle type of thing in the sense that Sugumi needs a Meister and both Mimi and Anya want to be her Meister. So the whole series is about them fighting over her, but becoming good friends in the process. It reminds me a lot of the movie Sky High, where it shows the perspective of sidekicks who want to be treated the same as superheroes. All right guys, that's all I got for you. I hope you enjoyed the video. I will see you guys in the next video. Make sure to click the annotation right here to subscribe and also make sure to check out the rest of my videos right here. I will see you guys in the next video of Greek Otaku. Have a great day and remember to stay animated.